Which is better, Hip Key or Trezor? Let's discuss. Trezor is a hard wallet designed to provide secure storage for cryptocurrencies, and meaning it stores private keys offline. Now, from that situation, it reduces the risk of hacking and unauthorized access compared to hot wallets connected to an internet. Now, Trezor devices have a pin code to access the wallet, adding an extra layer of security. As you can see it from here, you can go offline with Trezor. You own 100% of your coins, your wallet is 100% safe online, and your data is 100% anonymous and don't need to have an online exchanges, right? Now, Trezor is designed to be user-friendly with a simple and intuitive interface for managing cryptocurrency holdings. Trezor also provides a recovery seed during setup, allowing users to recover their funds in case the device is lost or damaged as you can see here this is the uh, treasure safe 3 with um a passphrase and secure element protected you can check the products from different colors from galactic rose to a stellar silver and solar gold plus the cosmic black we also have the uh, treasure model t a coin security with a touch screen and of course the uh, treasure model one the variants are black and white. Now you can also see uh, the um, the Trezor Safe 3 right here in different colors and variants. And again, um, Trezor provides a recovery uh, seed during setup allowing you again to uh, recover your funds in case your device is lost or damaged. And also it supports a broad range of cryptocurrencies including major ones like bitcoin ethereum litecoin and many erc20 tokens now the firmware used by trezor is open source allowing the community to review and contribute to its development now from this uh, perspective it enhances transparency and security trezor regularly releases firmware updates to address security vulnerabilities and improve the overall performance of the device Trezor supports the use of passphrase, providing an additional layer of security for advanced users. Now, if you ask me, since our Trezor is a hardware wallet, it helps users like me maintain the uh, privacy by keeping the uh, private keys offline and away from potentially compromised devices. Right, and that's good. That's one of the best things using Trezor, and of course. Trezor comes with it, its own cost and cons. It's not perfect. Let's discuss on that. Basically, Trezor devices comes with a uh, price tag, right? As you can see it from here. And users may find them relatively more expensive than other types of wallets, especially software wallets. Like, for example, Trezor, uh, say, 3 is $79. Trezor Model T is $179. Trezor model one is 59 and allowed more say for example if you check the accessories right here the uh, Trezor keep metal 12 word recovery seed is off for $99 and the crypto tag Z is is for 129 they also have selling the bundles like twin bundles for uh, these prizes twin bundle one twin bundle T the tre tre Trezor legacy bundle and the globe a silicon protection case for Trezor Model 1 hardware wallet right here so you can also check the different variants if it's available right here and also the Trezor cables right here so these are the prices that you might want to consider because again users must have access to the Trezor device to access their funds and if the device is lost or damaged or stolen recovery using the acid phrase is necessary right now from here as you can see while treasure is highly secure it's not entirely tamper proof if someone gains physical access to the device there may be potential risks and the initial setup process including the generation of a recovery seed may seem complex for users new to cryptocurrency wallets However, this complexity is inherent in maintaining a high level of security. Now we go over to our next contender, which is gonna be 
Keep key. It is also a hardware wallet designed for storing and securing cryptocurrencies and it provides enhanced security by keeping private keys offline in the hardware device, minimizing exposure to potential online threats. It has a pin code and recovery seed, adding layers of protection to the wallet. Now, the device features a user-friendly interface with a large screen such as this one making it easy to navigate and verify transactions. Also, KeepKey supports a variety of uh, cryptocurrencies, such as uh, this one, including popular ones like Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and several ERC-20 tokens. And the uh, shape Shift integration, because um, KeepKey has integrated with uh, ShapeShift, allowing users to exchange cryptocurrencies directly from the hardware wallet without the need for a separate platform. Now, during the setup process, KeepKey provides a recovery seed that users can use to recover their funds in case the device is lost or damaged. And the firmware used in KeepKey is open source, enabling the community to review and contribute to its development. Now, the transparency enhanced security, and again, it's compatible with popular wallets such as uh, Electrum and My Ether Wallet, providing users with flexibility in choosing their preferred software interface. And again, um, KeepKey is not a perfect uh, platform. It also has its uh, share of cons because when you go here, It comes with a certain price and some users might find it relatively more expensive as you can see it from here compared to other types of wallets, especially software wallets. Now, while KeepKey supports a variety of cryptocurrencies such as these tokens right here, it may not support every new or obscure token immediately and users should check the list of supported assets. And users need access to their KeepKey device to manage and access their funds if the device is lost or damaged as you can see it from here. This is the hardware wallet, alright? And while KeepKey provides a high level of security, no device is entirely tamper-proof. If someone gains physical access to the device, there may be potential risks. And again, when choosing a cryptocurrency wallet, it's essential to consider your specific needs, preferences, and the level of security you require. Because KeepKey is generally regarded as a secure hard wallet with a user-friendly interface, but it's important to stay informed about any updates or user reviews from these hardware wallets. You can do the same with um, Trezor. And again, the choice between KeepKey and Trezor depends on individual preferences, priorities, and specific features that are important to the users or you. You can, you know, both KeepKey and Trezor are hardware wallets designed to provide a secure offline storage solutions for cryptocurrencies. And again, as always, it's essential to weigh these factors based on that alone. You can always check their official websites to get more information or any updates to new features that may have been introduced since the recording of this video. Ultimately, the better choice depends on you, your individual needs, and a matter of preference. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.